funding, both public and private, is a top priority of the Florida State University's new president, Eric Barron. FSU Headlines reporter Tawatha Valentine is standing by with a recap of President Barron's first day on campus. Tawatha? Thanks, Dennis. I'm standing outside of Florida State University's president's office. Dr. Barron is no stranger to Florida State. He graduated class of 73 with a bachelor's degree in geology. The campus is completely different. That's, that's fascinating. I've known my roommate for 30 years. That's a distinct advantage over walking into my dorm room and, uh, and wondering what this person was going to be like. And I, I must admit, though, I feel like I have a really lot to learn and I wonder how everything works. That's pretty similar to the way it was when I was a freshman. One of Barron's main priorities, focus on fundraising. His current goal is a five-year, $1 billion campaign. I really want to see the synergism between a strategic plan, the fundraising of the university, and how it is that we show our face to the world. And so those are the things that are first on my mind. But of course, we're also going right into a legislative session, and that's going to be extremely important for the university. In early January, the present collided with the past on Florida State University produced television program, Issues in Education. <laughs> Former President T.K. Wetherill interviewed Barron about his goals for education at Florida State. Barron's thoughts? Bring a tighter sense of community to this large campus. Why can't you act? with the sense of community of a small liberal arts college while providing this enormous breadth of opportunity. As far as the Association of American Universities, Barron believes that Florida State is headed in the right direction for membership among the nation's top research universities. Dennis? Thank you, Tawatha. Now, former president T.K. Weatherell may be out of office, but he's not off campus. He's back in the classroom teaching as a tenured professor at the College of Education.